I feel like Vitafly gonna recap this and say God he caught a 30 on the dime roll. So all y'all wanna know what happened, I'm gonna tell you what happened. He got smoked. That one was crazy out of the game. Sometimes that's Peter, nobody that knows body. Hit his area with 51. Everything in the Vitafly. We used to rap it like that. I already know that I can cuff you, I'm a cheater. Hey, uh, stick up. This to all my exes, I let go, I don't miss ya. Put your flesh in sticks, light show, we gon' get ya. Pussy got me out of this world if I kiss ya. Put some respect on your name if I hit ya. Middle school, inner school, tryna get a lissa. If it's up, then it's stuck, slide, I won't dish ya. Is you ready like I'm ready? Is you ready like I'm ready? Is all I wanna know. Huh? How's it looking? What's popping with the population, huh? It's about that time. Oh, okay. Is it about that time? It's about that time. Bro. Because you've been sleeping. Yeah, I you know. you've been sleeping. I was hit. Oh no 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 no. no. So where should I start? You know, because I know you 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 probably think that just because it's 2020 that 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 mook probably gonna get smoked. And I I, I will take you back. Oh, I will. Who? who, who what you talking about? I want to know. All I'm saying is. What you saying? In three days, we really about to find out. If Mook still got it. If he got it like this. If he, still if he got, got it. If he got it like these lames act invincible until the kids slam on him like Vincent do. I never knew sensible. My cake good. And I've been great with this math shit. Every class I'm the principal. Mm -hmm. Y'all niggas minuscule. What I got intent to prove. Okay, I'm a fool since I finished school. Shit is cool. All the hating and dissing. Because listen, when y'all done, I'm going to be paying for my tuition. See, I beat the system. I'm a crook with a degree. He a messenger. He probably think Booker T was a wrestler. He was. You, you, he was. Man, listen. He was. I got packages. Look what I sent to you. The kid finished lead with a... I could write a book with a pencil. Like, see, this is the Smack DVD. If we get Smack DVD murder, that old murder, mm -hmm. that... Do rag with the flap down, old murder. Nah, nah. <laughs> with the flap down. We gonna flap down today. Listen. What's up? Flat down ain't been cool since Nellyville. Alright? Flat. Okay? Flat down ain't been cool since Dipset had the pink ones and you had to have the mink coat with it. Alright? All I'm saying is, what we saying? it ain't gonna go down as easy as you think. Now, the face off. Yeah. You know, Rock, I I feel like you need to, you there in, in wrestling. Uh -huh. Some of the best wrestlers, like the best like wrestlers that are most intimidating, they usually have somebody talking shit for them. Oh. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, Brock Lesnar had Paul Heyman. The reason why Brock Lesnar had the dude talking so much trash, because oh, whenever then, Brock talked, it was loud. No. And Undertaker had Paul Bearer. Yeah, you know. exactly. He had to have a spokesperson. Kane had Paul Bearer, too. You got to have somebody to talk for you, mm -hmm. because when you talk, sometimes it, it you, you don't sound... Smart. I'm. I'm. I ain't. I'm not coming at your intelligence. I'm not. I'm just saying the way that Rock argues is like a baby mom that just wants to win the argument. It's just when you're just saying the same thing or saying it in a negative term. It's like all you doing is just talking. All you doing is just talking. Well, I'm trying to talk to you. Well, you just trying to talk to me there. Why? Why are we so aggressive? I'm. Right. He's saying the same thing to you, you know what I'm saying? I, the face-off still has me a little weary, but I still believe that Rock can actually still come out of this with a win. I'm, I'm just saying, because Rock has been here. He, he's very emotional, he's very passionate, he's very angry. Okay. But he's still Rock, though, is what I'm saying. He, he, he's still Rock. You ain't got to see if Rock still got it, because Rock been Rock. Uh -huh. So I'm, I'm right now. I'm still on the fence. Before, before this video is over, I'm going to have my definitive answer. But just you gotta hold yourself together. Bro. Right. Okay. So listen. Right. You have the face off go down, and I think it was conducted in the way it needed to be. You know what I'm saying? Like Black stays in the middle, doesn't say much. He does what he needs to do. Yeah. Ask simple questions here and there, and more, murder move control the face off. It's 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 clear and 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 evident. Right? That's a fair point. Um, the way he's going about it is the way he's supposed to be going about it. He's saying, look, I the, I think the most powerful part of Murder Moose's whole dissertation, <laughs> per se, mm -hmm. ev the, out of everything that he said, I think the most powerful point that he got across was you couldn't be you standing next to me. 
And I agree with that so much because when you look at somebody who has the star power that Murder Mook had mm -hmm. from the DVD era, from being a enigma to being that figure mm -hmm. in battle rap, the, the logo for years, like he was the one on the top of the mountain. Mm -hmm. When Rock is making his ascension from the bottom, like going through all of the battles from the Charlie Eclipses to his come ups to him versus JC on Born Legacy to all of the battles where he comes up, mm -hmm. It might have been really different, a different trajectory if Murder Mook is standing right there in his corner during every battle. Because you can, people can say what they want, but him standing right there for every single battle, it would have meant something. You know, that, that nostalgic look of him standing there is almost like he's standing there in his corner giving. Because if Murder Mook stands behind you mm. and is reacting to your bars and, and egging you on, it's mm. kind of like he's co-signing you. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Like, right. like he's like Jay-Z Memphis bleaking mm. you. Like, yeah. this is the next one. Mm -hmm. But Mook is making it like, I stepped out of the way mm. and what you looked like was a level of me not supporting you to let you become who you are. Mm -hmm. And, you know, that to me meant a lot. But, you know, a lot of battle rappers... A lot of fans, a lot of other folks have been saying that there's things that Mook could have done in his absence. You know what I'm saying? He could have at least came to some battles. He could have endorsed the battle rap culture. He had a podcast. He could have had a battle rap on there. Mm -hmm. So people are looking like he's only coming back now because the money is involved. Now, while I feel like, I, and I feel like. I, I, was, I wasn't trying to do it, but you made me fall into it. And I feel like mm -hmm. uh, Murder Mook, while he did control the face off, I still cannot take away from the 30 plus battles that Rock has had. Here we go. You see what right, I'm right, So I'll we 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 gotta be honest. Got you know what I'm let's saying? go. We're gonna so, be honest, we gotta keep it a buck. Yeah. Murder Mook has in the last 10 years, maybe three battles. Right? Maybe three. Iron Solomon, Verb, two on two. And Mook. I mean and, and uh, Lux. And Lux. Four. Well four four. Four battles in the last ten years. Mm -hmm. Rock has three and a half. Three and a half. Really, three solo. Three solo. We'll count solo. Three solos. But yeah, yeah. There we go. Three right. back. Go ahead. Rock has thirty. You know. What I'm so when when people tell me, I just say this, right? Make it make sense that somebody who has three battles, right? Mm -hmm against somebody who has a way better rock's resume is way better than murder moves resume wise resume way better it's not even comparable you can't even compare resumes mm -hmm. legendary shit like being legendary mook has that because he's he's he he helped transcend the whole culture you see what i'm saying like we can never take i can never take away the fact that he helped build this culture because when you look at smack dvd era Right? When the DVDs first came out, and mm -hmm. I know you're a fan of this, they had the 50 Senses, the Diplomats, mm -hmm. the BMFs, mm -hmm. the Jeezys, the, all these DVDs, right? Mm -hmm. Bootleg store DVDs, et cetera, et cetera. Don't Second it, right? Mm -hmm. Once we got past the DVD, that part was only watchable once. Right. We only watched that once. Like, you see that once, cool. But the battles you became back. a staple. Mm -hmm. Like, we used, you started copping up DVDs. Just, just for the battle at the end after a while. Yeah. After 50 Cent and all of them, the, the big time DVDs. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. After a while, it was what battle is on here. Is it Murder Mook battling outside against Party Yardy? Is it uh, them battling him and Lux in the, in the barbershop? Is it Rex battling with all the chains on? Like, we remember, is it him versus Sirius Jones in the barbershop? Mm -hmm. Down his head, down his head, dot, mm -hmm. dot, dot. Mm -hmm. That is legendary, legendary. shit. Mm -hmm. We can never take that away. You can't. But when I'm talking about right now, mm -hmm. Right now, as we speak, who's doing hottest shit right now? And it's on you. The floor is yours, brother. I want to say the best explanation would be comparing Joe Lewis mm. to Mayweather. Mm. We all know that Joe Lewis or, or Rocky Marciano, whoever. I, know, I whoever, like that one better. Rocky Marciano to Joe Lewis. I mean, to, to Mayweather. Rocky Marciano was in the game back in the day. It was back in them times. Like, it was cool. Like, you know what I'm saying? Rocky Marciano, he was a legend in the game. But Rocky Marciano was also fighting in bars. 
He was also mm. fighting in, in little tiny venues. Like it maybe was thirty, maybe thirty people in that building where they saw the fight, or it was it was disclosed to famous people at that time. Right. Mayweather front and center. Mm -hmm. Not only are you getting pay per views, mm -hmm. everybody sees the pay or pay per view. You get you not only do the the famous people get to see you, they pay specifically to see you. to see you. There is documented proof. Of the kills, you can't. I, 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 I'm you. In order for you to find old Rock Marciano, Rocky Marciano fights, you gotta, you, go like, you gotta find that on the real to real. <laughs> yeah, you, you look at Mayweather fights right now. There's a top ten knockouts right now. Yeah. So the thing about Battle Rap, in in the same sense, is what have you done for me lately? Mm -hmm. Well, lately, Rock has been known to be uh, on, on top tier status. Lately. Rock has been the one holding. He was holding the dot mob. Uh, 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 he was holding that 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 chain for a minute until it was time for him to get on his own thing. Lately, Rock has been known to battle legends and win mm -hmm. because when he when you name uh, uh, it ain't like this. It, it, Mook ain't the first legend that Rock has seen. Right. He's seen a hollow. That's still a debatable. A lot of people got Rock winning that battle. Okay. You see him versus Goods. He got a little bit winded, but a lot of people still. Even us, ourselves, when we did that battle bar for bar, Tay Rock won that. Okay. So it's not like Rock, Rock can't fight legends. And anybody that Mook has currently battled, other than Lux, Rock has either already battled or, or it's not even in the talks. I'm talking a battle in that person. Grand battle verb is a good bro. That's what I'm saying. He hasn't battled Verbin, he hasn't battled uh, Iron Solomon, and he hasn't battled Lux. But these are the names that people aren't even putting Rock. I mean, uh, nobody, I'm not saying nobody's looking to see that, but that's a, the, all of those battles are curveballs. Mm -hmm. When you think of Rock, you think of pure, straight killers that are out here killing shit right now, and the only thing he needs is a top tier name. And just another name to cross off the list, why not make it Murder Mook? Mm -hmm. It's personal, it's all of this, it was the big brother. Bullshit. You're you're a legend. In order for me to maintain my legendary status, I have to kill you. Mm -hmm. So with that same mentality that he had for Goods, that same mentality that he had for Hollow, I believe that Rock is still wearing that same mentality for Mook, if not even more. I think I have Tay Rock. Too. Uh, I feel like it's mm -hmm. going to be even worse because the end. Of, like we have to remember that these two were affiliated with the same team at mm -hmm. one point. Regardless of whether one had uh, uh, a big time part part in the, in the other one's career, you know what right. I'm saying? Even if Mook did, was not really, you know, a, a, a visual character in Rock's upbringing, mm -hmm. Rex was more so that. Right. Um, they were still under the same umbrella. Dot Mob was Dot Mob. When Dot Mob's flag wasn't being waved as well, K Shine Rock was the ones that was like outside having fights outside you know and as in battles outside you know pretty much keeping it alive but you never and really saw them two being like no a no 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 because shine had the zip them up thing and rock had his cave game that's what i'm saying you know? so so what i'm saying is this the 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 the, the energy that he's gonna have when you seen shine versus rex mm. Shine was he wanted that win. Yeah. Badly. That was he did different. that joint at the end where he faked that mm -hmm. psych a lot. Mm -hmm. Zip him up. It was personal. You know what I'm saying? That's personal. personal. This is more personal than that though. Really? The reason why yes, it's personal. See, the way Mook talks, and I will say this. If you didn't think Mook was gonna win, seeing him talk this week, a lot of people don't even haven't even taken in, haven't intellectualized the fact. That Murder Moot and Tay Rock arguing with each other superseded any battles being released this week. Mm -hmm. People don't even, don't even remember the fact that ain't no been no drops this Kings week. Kings versus Queens was last week. They, they dropped. And you everything. got you got face offs, and that's it. That's it. And and, and these face offs, Murder Mook is able to project himself and talk in a way where he's like, see what I'm saying? Like this is what I'm saying. Yeah. Like you, like everything that Rock is trying to get across, he's telling them like, this is the reason why I'm gonna beat you. Mm -hmm. See the thing is. Mook is from Harlem. Niggas from Harlem are slick talkers. They could talk their way out of out of out of a jail cell. Uh -huh. Niggas is slick talkers, but the thing is, the slick talk is good, but it has to translate on camera because he can say whatever he wants. Mm -hmm. People are saying murder Mook control the face off. That is great. 
He could he got his points across. Rock gave point after point for making his point. Yeah. But you have to remember, all of that don't matter Saturday night Come at on nine, now. at ten, at eleven, whatever time these two are in front of each other. Gotta rap. You got to rap. You gotta rap. That all this if so, what good is it? To gain the world and lose your soul. Mm. You could be all sizzle and no steak. Mm. You can have all you do, all of the talking. We've seen so many battle rappers do a lot of talking. Look at what Cassidy did. Cassidy had the base face off, best face off ever. I, listen, I could name I could name a few of those. <laughs> they had great face off. Come on. Cassidy had a great face off. Great. Jay Mills had a great face His off. His face off was legendary. <laughs> but what happened? Shy, shy, uh, 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 wait, who else? Who else? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Um, damn. What's the name? Um, uh. It's a bunch of them. It's a bunch of, but Lux, Lux and Surf, those face-offs was good too. Surf and Reed, those were good face-offs, but it didn't translate the weight. Like, the thing is, and it's funny too, because a lot, I think all of those were Harlem niggas, except for Cassidy. Because Goods ain't from, yeah. So. You got those face-offs. Yeah, both both of the Cassidy face-offs. Him and Arsenal <laughs> and him and Goods. But you still gotta look at because it looked good and it sound good on that face-off, it ain't it may not translate the same way once they start rapping. The only caveat is that Murder Mook doesn't know about. Like even though mm, mm, and this just came to me. Even though Murder Mook is the legendary name and the way that he writes, he tries to prepare it for a large crowd. I'm just rapping. Mm -hmm. And it's just for you. Like these things are like some of Murder Mook's stuff might not have to go over heads because there's no there's no heads for it to go over. Mm -hmm. You get what I'm saying? But Rock can do it no Rock can hold his own no matter the stage, no matter the setting, no matter what it is. I just I feel like after the first round for Mook, like the first round for Mook is going to be incredible. And I and I can just see that. But there are two things that we gotta fear. The long stretch of that third round and second round rock. Mm -hmm. Um there's a couple things. The things that I learned is that it, through the face off, I learned rock is not good at face offs. No. And <laughs> no. you know, I, that's the one thing I did gain from that. I've learned that Mook is gonna definitely be using angles because the way he's talking and the way he's projecting himself, mm -hmm. see what I gotta say, you're gonna see on Sunday, you're gonna see you on Saturday, my bad. Mm. And I see that although there is a competitive nature, I think after this battle happens, there will be an amount of respect for each other. Mm. Um, because at the end of the day, you know, this is just battle rap. These are battle rappers. There's nothing, it's not life and death, you know what I'm saying? Like. You want to see a good battle, you want to see a good competition, but at the end of the day, I feel like there's still some sort of, there will be some sort of respect there, right? Uh, yeah, obviously. So, um, going further, uh, when I look at, and then this is the next thing I'm going to talk about, I'm going to talk about who's better at what, and then I'm going to talk about what each person needs to do to win. And right. this is just from my perspective. I feel like Rock is the better puncher, by far. Because Rock, he can go line for line for line for line. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Not he's he's not at the elite level. Rumney, Av, B Magic to could punch every single bar. Line, Gigi, Gotti, yeah, yeah. every fucking bar type shit. But he can go every bar, two bars, yeah. punch, punch, two bars, punch, 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 three bars. Punch. He has enough the way he can keep going like that, right? right? And with Mook, sometimes he does these long, drawn-out schemes mm -hmm. where, to me, I'm just looking at it like if he gets too wrapped up in these long schemes mm -hmm. that are not leading to, if it doesn't lead to anything crazy, mm -hmm. and Rock is just going line after line after line after line, you know, he could get caught behind. Now, Mook is the better schemer to me. Yes, right? I, I can see that. Right? I can see that, yeah. I feel like, and I feel Vlog, like... Vlog won't recap right. this is uh, <laughs> I feel like Mook can get into certain patterns of rhymes mm -hmm. better. Yeah. But I like Rock's cadence better. What Rock does cadence-wise, when he's snapping, you know, uh, uh, let him play my way. I bet I spray my K, I knock his head over his shoulder. I sit day by day, the caliente, the caliente, the cow will intake. He's good at, he's better at that type of shit. Yeah. Rock has the more updated style to what we watch in 2020, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. So style-wise, I like Rock. 
punch lines, I like rock. And these are just the advantages. Um, schemes, more so mook. Personals, more, more so, so mook. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like he's more, he's a more, that's what he's Personals, better at. Personals, angles, the all angle, of that. All of right? But when it comes to me, and when I look at intangibles, mm -hmm. like when I say intangibles, I'm talking about what you were saying as far as there's parts in this battle where you get to that that stretch in the second or mm -hmm. that stretch to end the third mm -hmm. or you know the fucking uh, the Glock semi. I put hollow inside of the box. It's not, not empty. empty. That's happening in the middle of a round. Those parts that are gonna blow open the round, mm -hmm. where I kind of to me has those pockets of material. Mm -hmm. That that and that's an intangible to me. And the X factor is the overall X factor to me in this whole battle is who's going to be able to have the actual bigger individual moments, right? And when I say individual moments, I'll just refer to Ooh. a battle that I've seen recently, right? And I'll give a shout out to these guys. It's not even two big MCs. Um, Hayes the Family Man versus Clone, right? Mm. They battle on King of Dot, right? Hayes has more bars. Clone has bigger moments. Mm -hmm. You see what I'm saying? Bigger individual moments yeah. in the battle. But the other person had more bars. So right. the one with more bars throughout the battle, but I'm talking about the one who can have the bigger individual moments. Mm -hmm. I feel like Rock has those. And lastly, when I'm saying who I feel like, uh, what I feel like the keys to victory is, for Mook, the most important round for Mook to win is the first. The, yeah. mo the reason why I feel like the most important round for him to win is the first is because if he goes down 1-0 to Tay Rock, Tay Rock's not losing two rounds in a row. No. You see what I'm saying? Nope. That's why I feel like that's the most important, the most important round. Now, on the flip side, mm -hmm. the most important round for Tay Rock to win is the third. Yeah. The most important. You see what I'm saying? He lets off the gas on the third. He has to win the third round yeah. because it's hard to go up 2-0 on move. Right. You see what I'm saying? So this is the things that I've intellectualized over this time for us to have this conversation. Mm -hmm. And I knew it wasn't going to be a five-minute one. No. Uh, no this one I five. feel like... Yeah, right? Uh, he's got to have, Mook has to win the first round. If Mook doesn't win the first round, a second round it's Rock comes be, out, what are we doing? It's going to be downside. You see what I'm saying? It's going to be downhill. And when Rock spoke, and I heard from him earlier this week, he's already done. He's been done for a while. Practicing. That's what he's doing. He's practicing. He's getting ready. He's still on caffeine doing the show. Ain't nobody going to be on caffeine doing no show and they're not ready. You see what I'm saying? So he's personally ready. How do you feel about... Um, What's more important? Who's key fig? Whatever the case may be. I mean, basically, you 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 hitting everything in the right direction. Like I think we're we're on the same page instead of like before. I was gonna try to go against you. Like I was I was really about to be like, no, whoever you pick, I'm gonna go against you. We've been sitting at the same table for, for a minute now, so it's like it's not even a, a, a strategy anymore. It's more of a a, a a a focused opinion. Yes, sir. And it seems like, from what that we see and uh, all of the evidence, if we were detectives, mm -hmm. it looks like it's a closed case. It is up to Mook to open that thing back up. Mm. And the only way he can do that is he has to win that first round. He has to win the first round. Because if he thinks it's going to be a long stretch, you can't give us that first round. No. Nah. Usually, Mook is going to give you that first round, too. Because, mm, like I said, what toppled him and Bird... You can debate that first round. If, he, if whoever wins that first round to you, that's who wins that battle between him and Bird. Same thing with him and Luck, with Mook and Lux. The second time around on Stonehouse, it was because of the whole thing that Lux went first. He said, I'm tired of hearing all this mumbling. And then when he took the journal, big moment. He had to do rag, that old murder. Things like that, that he's going to win that first round. If he chooses to not do any of that and try to save it for the second or the third, it's going to be an uphill battle because... Rock is not about to let you win that second round. It, it, it's He's already known to be a second round monster, not to mention he's been tweaking the fact that his second round is that way. But it's another thing that I paid attention to was Rock has been paying attention to that first round too. Because you remember that first round versus Geechee Gotti. Ooh, it was very hard to beat. But let me tell you something, Rock overcame that and that is how Rock won that bet. Same thing with him and Goods. Rock had to... These things can topple. The best way I can put it is that I, I'm, I'm going to say Tay Rock 2-1. That's an that's, that's expert opinion. No math hoffa. Uh, uh, but 
it still can go either way depending on the personals or the angles. Like if the personal or the angle hits in that third round, ugh, that's something he'll save. Uh, when I look at things from all like all things considered, uh, you have two MCs that clearly have their plans on how they're gonna win. Go ahead and win this battle. Um, one thing that could help Mook that I've never saw him do before, nobody's ever mentioned this, he's never rebuttal. You know what I'm saying? Like he doesn't, I haven't seen it. He, did, he, he did do the joint with Lux, when, uh, with yeah, the Yeah, I'm talking about recently though. I'm talking about in a battle recently. I feel you. Not no shit from before we were blogging. Not, you know what I'm saying? Like, oh yeah, no. That was before no. I was even blogging. No. Um, no. Yeah. I'm talking about rebuttal, you know what I'm saying? I ain't telling him to go out there and risk it like Serve trying to spit a bunch of rebuttals and turn it to play off Paul George. I ain't talking about that. I ain't fucking talking about that. But maybe an experiment, if it landed, that's different. Yeah. Uh, for Rod, the, the, what he can do to win this, he's got to stay on the gas. Yeah. 110%. Yeah. Don't do the person. You have to, work. like... You have to t treat this battle like it's hollow all over again. Yes. You see what I'm saying? Oh, that's, that's like it's calico mm -hmm. all over again. Mm -hmm. Like it's ill will all over again. Goods. Like it's goods. Like it's JC. I'm by the buck. I keep banging on the machine like my dollar. Like you have to really jump in that bag. And with all things said, um, I do have Rock winning 2-1. Um, and the reason why I have Rock winning 2-1 this is a punching error. Uh, Punchlines mean a lot. It, they don't mean everything. Cause I just seen Arsenal win against official, and he ain't really use no punches. He like, just yeah. He just got to it with line after line after line after line after line 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 lined her away. So I think it'll be an interesting battle. It's gonna be a great battle. Promotion's been great. Yeah. The talk has been great. The everything has been great, and now we're at this point here. Uh, what's up, man? Is that was my fight? So Rock two one. Um, give me first and third round. What you got? I'm, you a, I'm, I'm gonna say Rock second and third. Okay. God, I'm gonna say Rock. I, I yeah. Mm. Those those you you hear the rounds that you need to win, Luke. Right, right, right. And I haven't heard any bars. I didn't want to hear any, even in conversation in passing days. I know MC. Some people like I heard their bars. I told when I spoke to Rock last, I didn't want to hear nothing. Cause guess when I want to hear them. When you, on, on when you hear them, Halloween. When you hear them, we all hear them. Gotta sit down. Yeah, I don't want to. I don't want to have a plate of food before Thanksgiving. We all eat together. We yeah. gonna eat together. Plus, yeah. I don't believe anything Miss Hustle says at this point. And, and, as far as from a negative connotation to, towards uh, towards Rock, yeah, because yeah, yeah, she don't. They don't like each other. They don't. Win, so, um, so it should be very interesting. I, I'm, I'm looking forward to. Um, Having a good day, and um, you know, we will we'll definitely chop it up. Oh, yeah, um, I'm gonna be here. Yeah, we'll definitely be uh, re I'll definitely be screen recording that battle. I'm just saying, they got apps for that. that. I'm <laughs> just saying, I'll be watching it more than once. Mm. Uh, we'll definitely have a lot of conversations. Um, I think uh, to end this, um, I don't want to go on a, on a tangent. I feel like this is both murder mooks and Tay Rock's most important battle, and I'll tell you why. Mm. Well, Rock, I don't need to tell you why, because that's obvious. Murder Mook, I feel like this is his most important battle, the reason being is him and him and Loaded Lux the first time, they were both new guys, mm. That that's an anomaly. Mm. Uh, him versus Lux the second time, not really a big battle because it's on Total Slaughter. That whole card is kind of like, has an asterisk next to it because it's not, you know, even though the battle counted, and, yeah, it, I, he got away you, with I, it. But he ain't get away with it. it like, I like, feel you. It wasn't like smack standing in the middle. It was like a big ass stage with like a crowd that nobody saw. Nobody really watched Battle Rap there. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I'm talking about now. Uh, Verb Battle, uh, pretty important, but it was on Red Breed Entertainment. And Red Breed Entertainment was a very viable platform. Salute to them. It counts. Uh, it counts. That counts solidly. Mm -hmm. But he didn't win that battle. To me, he didn't win. Yeah, no. Um, mm -hmm. And if he. And. and He's battling somebody that used to be on his team that knows things about it. Rock probably knows things that he hasn't even said in any face-offs or anything that's going to wait until he uses in the battle. And the reason why I can't really trust anybody from Harlem's opinion, because uh, did you see the face-off? When Tori Doe said, 
Whether he wins or loses, I'm going to say he won because that's how we do our people. <laughs> I said, what the fuck? That's how you do your people. <laughs> that, that's how you do it. Because I, I, mm -mm. Mm -mm. Ask, I said, that's how y'all do your ass move. Did you beat chess? Now, how about that? Right. <laughs> like, yeah, what? yeah, yeah. Right. Ass move. Did you beat chess? Oh, no. no Tori got that. Did you? That's crazy. Did you watch the same battle? That was that was insane. Did you watch the same battle? Because no. I don't think you watched the same battle. Just because you're from the same place as somebody, you can't say they win. I'm from the Bronx, and I tell Chess every time he lost. What are you talking about? <laughs> right. But uh, hey, I'm from Philly, and I had Reed losing against Rum Nitty, like in the, in the predictions, and 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 I had to deal with that, right? Yeah. You know what I'm saying I had to deal with it. Saying, I already know that I can cuff you on the cheetah. Hey. Dick up, this to all my exes, I let go, I don't miss ya Put your flex in six lights, show we gon' get ya Pussy got me out of this world if I kiss ya Put some respect on your name if I hit ya Middle school, inner school, tryna get a Alyssa If it's up, then it's stuck, slide, I won't dish ya You gon' get your bitch fucked good just for dissing I can take my nigga nowhere, they mess up the kitchen Y'all be Papa Perky, ain't never had prescription Pussy so wet, might drown, might slip in 